I'm sorry. I truly am. We had no other place to go, and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. <clears throat> Elmira, I know what you said, but you have to let us go after Aerith. Not this again. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people, and I know they're never gonna let Aerith go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. We're all just numbers and meat Enough! to him. But... <sighs> Please. I need some time to think. You've all had a long day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? Can't sleep? No. You too? I heard footsteps. Sorry. Didn't mean to wake you. I'm a light sleeper. It's a soldier thing. <sighs> that flower you gave me the other night? That was from Aerith, wasn't it? I knew there was something weird going on. You buying flowers? They symbolize reunion, believe it or not. I was curious, so I looked it up. I tried to keep it alive as long as I could. But now, it's dead and buried. <sighs> like the bar. Our home, and everything else. <sighs> they took everything from us, again. It's a waste of time. That's not true. <clears throat> Thank you. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. 
If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out, however I can. Elmira. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can. So please. She's our friend. We have to help her. I always knew it was coming. Knew that one day, I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl. But not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. <clears throat> Daddy! <clears throat> Marlene. Are you going? I'm sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Hmm? <clears throat> Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy, Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? Mm. And that's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Okay. That girl, she was kind of... <sighs> what? Nothing. You should help her. We will. <sighs> You'll come back, right? Of course, I promise. Okay, you can go. <laughs> Barrett. She's tougher than me. All right, time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know. To rescue Aerith. To knock your so after bombing all the way reactors one next five. week. What do the eco-terrorists do? They go for the trifecta and take out Mako Reactor 7. Another attack by amateurs who don't care about collateral damage. The sky is falling and Avalanche is to blame. But wait! Did you know Wutai is the one funding their activities? For all their claims about fighting for the slums. They're nothing more than pawns of Wutai. Puppets dancing to the tune of their foreign masters. And that's the truth. Topside news delivered straight to your ears. That'll be five gil. Five gil, come on. Damn, man. Knew we couldn't trust Wutai to leave us alone. It's the reactors. They want them, we got them. Does this mean there'll what? be another war? After what they've done, what choice do we have? Five gil apiece, cough it up. The truth ain't free, you know. <sighs> we ain't no damn pawns of Wu Tai. I couldn't care less about the rest, but that shit. <clears throat> <clears throat> no one will listen to us. There's no point in even trying. I'm sorry. Hey. Hey, Tifa, listen. There's no room in this for regrets or what-ifs or any of that. All we can do is keep moving forward, keep following this path we chose. Wherever, so we can say we did all we could. I know. But right now, 
Instead of looking forward, you need to look around. Everyone here is terrified. So I'm asking you, don't.